chogu mimi na kuomba tafadhali na ufugaji wa samaki ghalabu umedhaniwa kuna wiri katika maeneo ambayo yako karibu sana na maziwa au bahari na wakenya wengi hawaja kumbatia katika kaunti ya Kakamega wakulima wameanza ufugaji huo kwa kasi na ujio wa kiwanda cha kutengeneza bidhaa za samaki umechochea zaidi kwani kinalenga kukuza ama kuuza tani ya samaki kumi tani kumi ya samaki nchini Italia kila wiki hata hivyo kulingana na wakulima wanakosa fursa nyingi kwani kaunti hiyo haiko kwenye kundi la uchumi samawati maarufu kama blue economy anavuarifu mwanahabari Alan Ochanda ni kwamba wakulima wanasema hatua ya kuagiza samaki kutoka taifa la Uchina pia limekuwa likiwaumiza ila kuna wingu la matumaini eneo la Malava County ya Kakamega tunamkuta laban mwanzo akiwalisha samaki anaowafuga kwenye vidimbi mia mbili. Mandhari ni tulivu na sauti za samaki wakiruka majini zinahanikiza mandhari. Anaungana nasi kwenye mazungumzo pasi na kusitiza shughuli zake akituhadithia namna alianza kilimo cha samaki mwongo mmoja uliopita ila amekuwa kwa kasi sana. Kuna fingerlings za tilapia, kuna fingerlings za mudfish, that is catfish na kuna fingerlings za ornamento. So hizo zote huwa tunasalisha katika hii farm na kupeana wakulima wetu waende wafuke katika vitimbu zao. Ni kilimo tu kama kingine kile ila kina faida zaidi na kinahitaji muda zaidi ili kufuatilia ukuaji wa samaki na kuwazuia ndege na wezi wanaonyapia kwa urahisi. Tembea vizuri. Katikati ya vidimbu hivi ni eneo maalum la kuangulia samaki. Hapa samaki wa kike huweka eneo maalum ili kutaga mayai ambayo baadaye huchukuliwa na kuweka kwenye kifaa chenye joto na baada ya siku mbili wanaanguliwa ili kuongeza mapato wanatumia ujanja zaidi wanageuza jinsia ya samaki kutoka kike hadi kiume tunaanza kulisha hormone hormone ambaye itatusaidia kukua haraka na pia ku reverse the sex ziwe male alone why male alone because male grow very fast Why do male grow very fast? Ni kwa sababu ya kike huwa inaweka ma, 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 mayai modomoni na basi haikuli. Lakini ya, ya kiume huwa haziweki, hazibebi mayai. Kwa hivyo zinakula haraka sana. Ya kike wakati iko na mayai inamaanisha kwamba iweke mayai modomoni na itakaa muda mrefu bila kukula. Sasa inafanya growth rate yake iwe very low na hata weight yake itarudi tena very low. Kumudu vidimbi mia mbili si rahisi kwani lisha ya samaki ni ghali mno. Hilo hata hivyo amelizamia na sasa wamevumbua kuangua mayai ya wadudu hawa aina ya black soldier fly katika eneo hili katikati ya shamba hili. Currently the cost of feeds is very high kwanza fish feed. And in our efforts to, to find innovative ways to curb the cost of feeds ndio tukaparana black soldier fly. So napata hii black soldier fly unadatumia kama feed ingredient. Na kama si feed ingredient unaweza pia pia live. Wanyama kwanza wanapenda ikiwa live hivi. So in our case tunalisha fish zetu kwa hii farm. Although fish ponds ni mingi lakini sasa zina act kama supplement. Licha ya kuwa na uwezo mkubwa wa kuzalisha samaki wa kulima kutoka kaunti hii ya Kakamega wanadai kuwa kaunti yao haijawekwa chini ya kundi la uchumi samawati maarufu kama blue economy kwani kuwekwa katika kundi hilo hutegemea kwa pakubwa kukaribiana kwa kaunti na ziwa au bahari hilo wanasema huanyima fursa kadhaa kutoweko hapo inatuwaziri kwa sababu kuna mashirika mbalimbali ambayo yanasaidia zile counties ambazo ziko kwa blue economy sasa haya mashirika haizingatii Kakamega kwa sababu wanasema sisi Kakamega County hatuko katika massive water. Lakini sasa tunaona ile sehemu ambayo tunachangia katika ufukaji na kutafuta soko ya county ya samaki Kakamega inafanya pakubwa sana hata kushinda zile counties zenyewe ambazo ziko kwa massive water. Kaunti ya Kakamega ina wakulima 1400 wa samaki waliosajiliwa na vidimbi 1500. Licha ya kutokuwa karibu na ziwa au bahari ndilo gatuzi la kwanza kulenga kuuza samaki taifa la Italia tani elfu kumi kila wiki. Hilo litafaulishwa na kiwanda cha samaki kilichojengwa katika kaunti hiyo ambacho ni cha pekee katika kaunti za Elreb yani Lake Region Economic Block. 
where you realize that it's a bit of a technical field and a normal farmer may not know the technicalities on how to handle the fish farming. So what, we, what the county has done, it has trained experts and they are, they are spread all over the sub-counties, all the 13 sub-counties and each expert is actually attached to a particular number of farmers and they do weekly visits to those farmers and they do monthly checks where they are able to pick the fishes from the they sample the fishes from the pond and they weigh them and that way you're able to constantly monitor the growth of the fishes with time and you're able to take just like a child when they're growing so from the weighing every month you pick the fish you weigh them and you know return it helps you monitor to know whether you're doing the right thing and the response from the feeds whether it's actually working. Kwenye kiwanda hiki kilichotuzwa cheti cha viwango vya kimataifa, samaki wafikapo ni sharti wafikie viwango hitajika, ikiwemo uzito na ubora kabla ya kupakia ili kuuza katika masoko tofauti. This uh, factory can actually produce and um, avail up to um, 10 to 15 tons of uh, finished product. Uh, however, um, for you to successfully distribute that you need to have the ready market that is um, that needs the the product but that is obvious because we have um, demand for fish which is um, actually beyond uh, what is being produced currently our production is very high and that's why we are focusing more on just revamping the the Kakamega Fish Factory that is in Lutoni that will help us do the first of all the training bit so we train the farmers to follow up on the harvesting and uh, just make sure that the safety of the fish from the farmer all the way to the factory is safe and then also to just make sure that the quality of the fish is up to the standard. Usimamizi wa kiwanda hiki unasema tayari una masoko katika mataifa 27 ya Ulaya na unakisiwa kuzalisha zaidi ya shilingi milioni 500 kila mwezi. Alano Chanda KTN News. Na tukitoka sehemu ya Kakamega tuelekee katika hospitali ya Rufaa ya Moi mjini Eldoret pale.